Uh, quite surprised to be honest. Like, I was just saying, this is the first time I've ever ran or trained on an indoor track. Um, so before this, I was just trying to put it on my head. I was like, nah, don't worry, it'll be fine, it'll be fine. And then, uh, but part of me was a bit like, oh, what if I'm not quite, you know, what about the bends? Because that's sometimes what trouble is, especially with people with quite long stride, which I've got. But no, it went, it went great. I felt really good, really enjoyed it. Like, the atmosphere was good. Um, and it beats running outside in the cold and wet and cross country, which is what I would do at this time of year. So you say it's your, your first time competing indoors. How have you trained specifically for this? I haven't really, to be honest. I've just kept my training the same as what I would for sort of normal winter base training. Um, yeah, like, <clears throat> used, I've just been keep doing long thresholds, hill running. I've been on the track once a week, but I haven't done any sort of specific work. Just been doing big volume sessions. Because um, my main focus is the summer, and I think sometimes people can get caught up in training too hard for the indoors and then being shattered by the time midsummer comes so I haven't really changed anything I'm just sort of doing it for fun and I'm enjoying it so oh, for your training you're based in Twickenham is that correct yeah. Yeah. it's at Mary's University and who is it you're training there with uh, train with Colin McCourt Andrew Asagi James Brewer uh, Rory Ches and then all my good mates train there as well so I love it and al already this year you've competed in Birmingham and Edinburgh um, so you've had sort of a quite a good busy start to the year. What else have you got planned after this? Um, I don't know at the moment. Um, I might be doing books next weekend, which is like the university championships indoors. But um, I don't know. I'll have to have a rethink and see what. See if I see if I'm doing anything else. I don't know. We'll see.